Yeah, Mike likes that. Alright, we got a deal. Let's go. Three million dollars. Count it. Boy. Yes, uh, Master. Pass away. Where are the bricks? You gotta take a drive, homie. Do I look like Miss Daisy to you, Bones? Huh? What's that green eyed nigga looking at, man, huh? What you looking at? What's wrong with you, Q Tip? Huh? Now hold on. Come on, let's do this. Hold on, man. Wait. Hey yo. 150 kilos. Pure Bolivian marching powder right here. Now we got a party, fellas. That nigga's got a wire right there! Hey, the police back up! Years of dedicated service to grow a shiny coat like this. Oh, I'll do it. 
last time on me. Kingston. I told you last week, I don't know anything about Q doing any dirt. He was a good cop. To the living, we owe respect. To the dead, we owe only the truth. Yeah, that's smart. Should be. It's Voltaire. Yeah, I guess he didn't know that cops never die. That's what the badge means. You should know that, Sergeant. You saying you'd lie for him? I'm saying I'm gonna do whatever it takes to catch the motherfucker who did this. The door is always open. Alright. What's going on, Marty? 
<laughs> so you're making new friends, huh? Yeah. <laughs> hey, look, I got a lighter if you want to burn that shit. I have to take it. <laughs> hey, look, man, I'm sorry to hear about Q. All right? I check with corrections. Shunt's still on side. Really? Doesn't mean he can't still pull some strings. You know what I mean? I guess we all gotta watch our backs. Yeah. Hey, hey, what's up with Bones? Nobody's seen his black ass since. Yeah. He's probably doing the Farrakhan thing, running around with his little bow tie, <laughs> talking about keeping it positive. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> I guess we all have to watch each other's backs, huh? Guess so. All right, uh, good to see you, Mike. How's the leg? Take it slow, Marty. Dan Sullivan, right? Yeah. Yeah. Quintana was my partner. I'm gonna be working this case with you. He's not even homicide. No offense, Lieutenant, but I know what I'm doing. Quintana was Marty's partner for eight years in narcotics. Nobody knows him better than Marty. I understand. I wasn't homicide. I got more convictions in one year than you have in your whole lifetime. I've been here for nine months. Exactly. We're looking for a cop killer. Captain. Uh-uh. You're working together. Period. You think you can keep up? It's your car, huh? Yeah. That's your gun. Box 17's most sophisticated handgun ever made. Let me see what you have. Let me see it. Just this. Right. Yeah. I I've seen that. That that looks like the piece that Jesse James used at the OK Corral. Standard issue suits me just fine. <laughs> Chase. You know this guy? Never seen him in my life. Why don't you take another look and give it more than a millisecond this time? I'm not asking you, I'm telling you. Look at the fucking picture. Like I told you, I don't know. Did you ever hear the expression, get more with honey than you do vinegar? Does anybody recognize this guy? What about you, Boy Scouts? You look familiar? Look, we know Quintana came here. You know he came here. Just tell us what we need to know. We know him very well. Or knew him, I should say. You think a cop dying is funny? Is that what you're saying? He was no cop. He was a crook. That's his old partner right there. Look at him. He just watched him get buried. I'd be very careful what you say next. He came in every month demanding we pay tax. 
chuck us down. Is that true? Are you lying to me? You could ask the bar owner of the Eros down the street. He'll tell you the same story. Eros? Eros. Take care of the crib, I promise. Can we talk about this tonight? I love you. You're having a kid? Yeah. Congratulations. I mean, I love your wife. Yeah. Well, we got something in common. <laughs> you got kids? Yeah, yeah. What the fuck is this? My apologies. I thought you guys were taking over Cantana's paper route. Where were you last Thursday night? You think I killed you? I'm just asking where you were. Not to say I can't choke a motherfucker if he get rough with my girls. Y'all ought to be looking at the other dude he came in with. What did he look like? A big son of a bitch with a scar over his eye. You know his name? Scary motherfucking asshole. So, uh, how long did you know Katana? Years. Yeah. For years. Was he, uh, on the level, you know? Was he... What? Is he a good cop? We're all good cops. Well, no. Look, did, did at times, like anybody on this job, was, was there questions about going too far? Were there questions about going over the line? Maybe. Maybe sometimes. But also, too, we, we took down a lot of fucking scumbags. Right. Hey. Hi, uh, you must be Dan. I'm Beth, Marty's extremely impolite wife. Sorry, we just showed up here without calling for Oh, uh, it's the crib fairy. Uh, <laughs> this is my new part, part, partner, Marty, and, uh, and his wife, Beth. Hi, it's uh, nice to meet you. I'm so yeah. sorry we just showed up here like no, this. this. I overheard Dan and... Oh, Casey, come here. This is this our is son, our Casey. Casey. He's not <laughs> using his crib anymore, so if you guys wanted to have it, it's... You could have it. <laughs> that's, um, are, are, wow, are that's you really you're nice. okay with this? Oh, yeah, I stopped using it last week. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, that's that's very sweet of you. Um, are you guys in a rush? Because we just cooked dinner, if you want to stick around. No. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm, we would love that. It's delicious. Best rice I ever had. <laughs> No, it's oh, good. It's really, it's really good. Thank Try you. Try the chickens, please. These plates, they're beautiful. Are they from um, Lebanon? Mexico, right? Mm. Yeah, it was just one of those impulse buys when we were on vacation in Oaxaca. Oaxaca? Mm. You know Oaxaca well. Really? Mm. Are you there on vacation as well? Not really. Um, Let's just say the doctors it's pretty much saved my life. When, um, when you, when you do? Four months. You know what you're having? Boy, girl? 
mix twins. <laughs> Good boy. Yeah? Good boy. I got a name. It's Lawrence. After my father. <laughs> you got a great woman there, kid. Take it from someone who's been married to one for 21 years. You take care of her above all else. Above being a cop, anything. Family comes first. Yes. Thanks. All right, what do we got going on over mm. here? Mm-mm. Uh, Lila put that up and... It's cheesy. No, no it's not. It it's is. Nice. It's, it's embarrassing. No. Do you play college ball or just Little League? You want to... Yeah. Um, almost played college. I had a few offers and was committed to Wisconsin when my dad died. Really, my dad died too when I was nine. I know how tough it could be. Here you go. To dad's. Was he a cop? Yeah. He was murdered during a simple traffic stop and they never found the guy. You want another? Yeah. I just don't want another young widow and her son to have to hear that their loved one died and we're sorry, but we couldn't solve the case. So here's a flag and a 21 gun salute instead of a father. That's why I became a cop instead of a ball player. You gotta do whatever you gotta do to make things right. What's going on with cues? You see anything? You find anything? Other than booze, crack pipes, and pinky slips, no. Alright, keep in touch. Yeah. I do. Now get the fuck out before I have to take you in. For what? For what? For trespassing, obstruction, tampering, this whatever. This is my building. Alright. Don't you think every black woman is on her knees? No. Ma'am, I, I am sorry. It's, it's, it's a misunderstanding. Great, thanks for finding my rent. There's police evidence. This guy, he, he pay you in cash? Mostly him and his partner. His partner? Big black Frankenstein looking asshole. It wrote me a check last month and shit bounced right back. You happen to have a copy of this check? You want to show me that warrant now, detective?
Hey, hey, hey. I'm Detective Sullivan. How you doing? Detective, oh, okay. Detective Sullivan. Uh, just want to introduce myself. I'm working the Quintana case. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So. What you need, baby? You know him, right? Yeah, yeah, I know. I was just wondering if you could tell me about him. He's one of the good ones. Sorry to see him go. You two were close? No, I wouldn't say we were close. I mean, we worked a couple of cases back in the day, but no, we weren't close. You ever been to the Arrows? The who? The Arrows. The Arrows. What is, what is the Arrows? Strip club on Nuss Avenue. <laughs> look at me, baby. I'm beautiful. Do I look like the kind of guy to get his fucking rocks off in a strip club? <laughs> you never been there? Nah, nah. Manager of the strip club said you were there last week with Sal Quintana and that you got into an argument. What are you fucking wise ass? I'm asking some questions. I want to rethink those questions. I should let him talk. What are you, you, you investigating me, Detective Sullivan? Huh? I'm just trying to solve the murder of a fellow cop. You treading in deep waters, boy. Now, Katana's been on this force for over 20 years. I've been here 19. And when a newbie like you, fresh out of his mama's pussy, starts bashing people's reputations. You ought to be very, very careful. Now, if you got some questions and you need some help, you need to make a fucking appointment with me, boy. But don't you ever in your fucking life come down here and question me in public. It makes me look weak and it makes you look like a fucking asshole. So you think the Lions are gonna make the playoffs this year? Are you retarded? Glass half full. You grew up in Madison. Your dad was a cop too. So you like it in detail? You're looking at my file. You know who I'm talking to. So you found just over four grand in Quintana's place. Just over three grand. Nice try. Just making sure. You're investigating the Quintana murder. So why are you talking to Fowler? You get a heart on every time two cops talk. I guess you IA guys have nothing better to do. Oh, yeah. Nothing better to do than to catch crooked cops. What do you want? What do you want to tell me? Well, what I want to tell you involves a lot of four-letter words, but it's going to get me into trouble. Then keep your mouth shut and know this. I've been looking into Quintana for a couple of months. And now I got a lead on Fowler and his partner, Jimmy Rogan. So if you learn anything about them, I suggest you tell me before I talk to them Thursday. I help you. You help me. All right?
said something and questioned me. Am I I'm not that I did it, dude. What did you do? Fucking lying. Somebody's fucking lying. I'm with your fucking team, Marty. I know, and I'm telling you I didn't do it. You better fix it. You better go after those motherfuckers and fix it. Fix it, goddammit. I'm not going down alone, Marty. Let's go, Have the starting lineup for the Pistons. None of them paid Quintana's rent a few weeks ago like Fowler did. Why did he lie to me about not having seen Quintana in a while? I, I, I'm not going to tell you how to do your job, but I think you're going in the wrong direction here. Most likely, Fowler was working undercover with Q. Of course, he's going to deny being with him. He's not going to trust you. You gotta be smart. Fowler is not gonna react well to being treated like a fucking suspect. Like I care about his feelings. Well, maybe Fowler borrowed money from Q. Maybe he's just a nice guy and wanted to help him with the rent. I hate he doesn't investigate nice guys. What'd you say? What are you talking about, I hate? Clark from IA got a file on Fowler and his partner Rogan. Oh, shit. He showed it to you? No. All I know is IA's been watching them and can talk. What do they have on them? I don't know. Clark's meeting with them tomorrow. something here, kid. What you got for me, Mama son? <sighs> Please, yo, you were condom this time. What the fuck is you talking about? You want me to shut this motherfucker down? Give me your best girl. Got a lot of fluids to release. Me so horny. Me so horny. Hey, look at Mama son. Make sure her poop is clean. Cause you know badass niggas like me. Got dicks fucked like a snake's tongue. I poke two holes at one, baby. Okay, okay. <laughs> you big Come on, baby. Yeah. Me love you a long time. Guys, it's the one done. I like that.
Hey, Bray. We gotta get out of here. Fall's dead. Call me. Everyone in homicide working this case. Kingston. Gotcha. How many cameras do you have around the marina? There's one other, but uh, the seagulls keep shitting on the land, so probably won't help. Any witnesses? No, nobody saw a thing. Uh, what have you got here? Eye in the sky sits 40 feet from the crime scene. Oh, perfect. Well, we'll see. That's perfect. You can go ahead and play. Bingo, we got him here. He's got uh, a hood. Can can you uh, can you can you slow it down? Sure can. How's that? It's good. It's good. It's, it's... Is there any chance you can zoom in? Zooming in, and there's your zoom. You can almost make out his face. It's with the bruise. You can see a bruise? Not on the perp, on you. Oh. oh. I was pitching to Casey last night, and uh, he wanted to use a bat, the aluminum bat and a hard ball. And uh, he got me good. He's getting strong. He got me good. How about this? 
That's better, but can you rotate it 90 degrees? That would give us a perfect shot. Sure. This was Homeland Security. I'm sorry, but uh, this is as good as it gets. Okay. Well, thank you. Can you can you burn it to CD? I'm gonna run it through our lab. Oh. Sure can. Yeah. Ooh, I appreciate it. Rogan knew he was being targeted. He was trying to get the fuck out of here. It didn't look like he was coming back. Well, what makes you say that? He had enough food and guns for an army. Got three dead cops. All killed before they talked to IA. Something bigger going on here. Here it is, it's all there. Uh, you know what, the lab guy owes me a favor. I'll get this done real quick. You go give the wife the bad news.
something if you know something please tell me Mrs. Rogan we can protect you a lot better than dead bolts wrought iron doors and a handgun like you protected Jimmy I'm done Somebody was chasing him? Said I'm done.
What? What do you mean? Maybe they deserved it. Maybe! We're still gonna fry the motherfucker who did this! Our job stays the same. Every lead in this case circles back to narcotics every single one. So? What if... What if... Our killer is a cop? He's not. So... We'll be right there. Come on. We gotta go. We lifted this from a cigarette we found at the Rub and Tug. And this from the cigarette we found at Robin's boat. Same brand of cigarettes, same guy both places. What's this fucker's name? Trayvon Richardson, aka Bones. <laughs>
look at this. This is Detective Sullivan. You struck them to stop the train right now. You hear me? Motherfucker, yeah. fuck you that? Detective. This is Rogan. I came by to get some of Jimmy's things and I just wanted to say thank you. Oh, well, it, it wasn't just me. I mean, the whole department was involved and, of course, my partner. Hey, Marty. This is him, Lieutenant Marty. Kingston. Yes, Sonia. Yeah. I'm so sorry about Jimmy. Thank you again, Detective. It's tough. Uh, see you tonight? Absolutely. Good. Need another beer? No, I'm good. I didn't know you know Jimmy's wife. I can't say that I know her. I've spoken to her a few times in the past. Is this rare enough? That's perfect. Really? Yeah. You like it that way? About what? What? What did you talk to Sonia about? I, I don't know. Whatever. Whatever, like what? What's the 20 questions? I'm just curious, that's all. Jimmy and I were up for the same promotion, right? I got it. I ran the unit. He had rocks with me, so did she. That's it? Wanna watch me pop Hey, out? good. Take, take him away. I'm cooking dinner here and he just wants to yap. Right. <laughs> I got I got a few pointers with the kickflip that you're... I, I used to be a skater. You, you should actually... You should see me at I used to have a half pipe. I have tons of pictures. Do you want to see them? Yeah. Inside the house. All right, yeah. come on. Mm -hmm. uh, here it is. Yeah, it's just on my grandpa's farm. You can tell it's getting kind of old. Mm -hmm. Here's another one. I don't use it anymore. Because the whole place reeks of garlic. And I hate Dan. garlic. Dan! Come on, let's go. It's ready. <laughs>
<laughs> so, uh, I just wanted to ask you a few questions about Lieutenant Kingston. I don't like him. Simple as that. Um, just... Uh, he was Jimmy's superior. In rank only. But that's not why I don't give a rat's ass about him. Ever since the White Alliance bust, he acted like his shit didn't stink. Jimmy said he copped an attitude. He wasn't one of the guys anymore. White Alliance? A biker gang moved here from L.A. and started dealing. Right. I never, um, I never saw anything about that in your husband's file. Of course you wouldn't. They were working deep undercover. Who's they? Jimmy, Tyrone, and Quintana, and Marty. They were all using aliases even in the department files. Since the Alliance fought off cops. That piece of shit that you killed was working for them, right? Why do you say that? Why else would he kill all the cops who busted the Alliance? God's country. Let's take a claim for myself where I belong. Your mother must be very proud. I paid my bills. Niggers around here can't get their kids diapers or milk, but somehow they can always afford to load up the pipe. I want to hear about the bust. I trusted Tommy. Marty, whatever the fuck his name was. Thought he was one of us. He said he betrayed his race. And he and his motherfucking bitch ass, no honor cops, stole my money. I had over three million in cash before they jacked me. Two million, according to court transcripts, two million. Exactly. Tell anybody? Oh, I told everybody. Who believe me? You know I'm telling the truth. Makes you say that? Because you're still sitting here. Quintana, Fowler, and Rogan is officially closed.
you're investigating them for shaking down a nightclub? Owned by Mayor Schiffman's son. Not a brilliant move. This has nothing to do with the White Alliance drug bust. What? Who else has seen this? Just you and me. Being the mayor's kid, I had to keep it quiet. But your partner sure was curious to read it. Did he see it? No. His name wasn't on the clearance. Here in IA, we actually follow the law. Kingston was a patient, and I'm looking for a copy of the receipt. What is her date of birth? 42066. Please hold. You have a zero balance, sir. Right. What credit card did I use? You paid the entire balance in cash. $212,405.18. Hey, if I help you solve the biggest case of your career, you don't fucking take my calls? Yeah, I uh, was at the doctor's with Leela. I had to be there, so she's unavailable for most of the... Everything okay? Yeah. Virus. All my files are corrupt. What are you doing here? I forgot something. Are you sure you're okay? Some rest. 
You know, look out for you and your family first. They told you that. Yeah, so that's a good idea. That's not a good idea. Good idea.
Hard to say definitively, but I think we'll find a match. How soon can we know? I'll have property bring the jacket over. We should know by morning. Great. Maybe we'll have better luck with this than we did with that marina surveillance video. What surveillance video? The, the one from Jimmy Rogan's murder? We never saw it. Spewing drug dealer one time to pay for my wife's cancer surgery down in Mexico. The insurance company was gonna let her die. 
You think I was gonna let that happen? I did it one time, but not my fellow cops. They couldn't stop. Those greedy motherfuckers forced my hand. They kept taking and taking and taking. IA was closing in. What am I supposed to do? IA was investigating them for shaking down a nightclub. They didn't know anything about White Alliance or any fucking money. Just leave it alone. Check with him, and I'll get back to you. Hey, let me know. Morning, sunshine. Did you stay out here all night, mister? You did. Oh, I fell asleep. You fell asleep on the couch. Uh 
I'll, I'll explain it when I get there. Just, 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 just forget about it. I'm coming in. Um, Are you sure, detective? I'm, I'm on my way. Hey, uh, don't tell anybody. Whatever you say. Thanks. Thank you.
you want. Huh? Is this what you want? I told you to leave it alone. Get up! Get up! Walk! Walk! Keep moving. Shoot me right. You're not gonna fucking talk your way out of this. No, I will. Oh, I do know, Marty. I know exactly what you're capable of. I do remember that you killed my wife and unborn child. You better fucking kill me. You better kill me right now because if I survive this, I'm gonna find Beth. I'm gonna stick a bullet in her. <laughs>
Thank you. 